And we are hard pressed to find people in our lives who have not been affected by this coronavirus pandemic. Our friend and colleague Leon Bibb is among them. And tonight he is going to share his personal story of loss and how this moment is an opportunity for all of us to find our own turning point. The numbers hit with enormous impact, further shattering our world and stiffening our backs as the figures flash on our television screens. The numbers of the nationwide dead show how widespread is the hand of COVID-19. The death total is now at 245,000 and still growing. It is difficult to get arms around such huge numbers, but think of it this way. For every one of the dead, grieving others are left behind. In many thousands of homes, there are empty chairs at the table. Since the pandemic began, three of my aunts have died in this season. Two were diagnosed with COVID. They were both in their 90s. They had other ailments, but both were in nursing homes and were diagnosed positive with the COVID virus. My Aunt Pearl, sister to my mother. My Aunt Dorothy, sister to my father. And a third aunt died this season as well, but of another ailment. Three of my aunts have died in less than a year. They were the last of that generation in front of my generation. So allow me to put faces behind numbers. And the old family photograph albums are graying images of times past. Frozen moments of the life of Aunt Pearl and Aunt Dorothy. This was decades ago when they were young before COVID stopped their bodies. Three years ago in her nursing home, we celebrated Aunt Dorothy's birthday. Her voice is stilled now, but precious video summons it from the past. What do you think about 87 years? I thank the Lord that he spared me to be here to see it. That's a good thing. Look beyond the numbers and make this a turning point in this pandemic. See beyond the number, the face value of the number, and realize it represents someone who loved life and left behind family and friends and neighbors and co-workers, all of us left grieving. We must turn back that continually gathering storm of COVID diagnoses and deaths. When precious life is taken, it leaves a hole in the lives of those who are left grieving. Reflect on those who left and think of those who are left behind. Remembering family and friends and all we love, for 3 News, I'm Leon Bibb.